It is already March, but I am going on my run today. I have an event in Fishers tonight. My podcast with Galen goes live tonight. It's so funny. I have my final on Monday. So this vlog is going to be a lot of me studying. And hopefully as soon as my final is over, I can get back into the swing of reading because I only read 17 books in February. I wanted to hit the 20 mark, had a reading slump. So yeah, I've had a reading slump. I've had a writing slump, had a mental slump, an eating slump. It's time to get back on track. So let's do that. I'm gonna go to the grocery store today. Finally gonna go to the dollar store. Oh, lots of things. So for me, it's really beneficial to write down what I need to do. This is an old one from yesterday, but I'm gonna write a new one for today. And I will link where I get my notepads in the description box. I get them from All Things Lillian. She's like my favorite place to get stationery and stickers from. Here is my day all planned out. So I've been able to get a ton of stuff done that I need to get done today. I went on my run, I showered, ate breakfast, which is an important thing for my <laughs> weight loss stuff. I went to the dollar store and got a bunch of stuff for Riley for her birthday, got some motivation gifts for Aaliyah. And then went to the grocery store, was able to film and edit an entire TikTok, which I put up, and then played webkins, got that all taken care of. It's almost three, we have to leave at 4.40, so I'm going to be studying the rest of the time. I don't want to, but I have to. Today is the day of my final and I'm a little nervous. Last time I got a 79, but I also knew exactly what to study for. So this time I don't really know exactly what I'm studying for. So I just want to get a 75 at the lowest. Ugh. I'll update you with what I get, but I don't know if it's gonna go well and whether I can apply to dental school after this. Oh, I mean, it depends literally on this final, so. You guys, she just got back with our grades. My test got curved. I originally got a 71 on the test and now that's been bumped up to, I believe, a C minus. And I got an 89 in the class, so I passed. I get to apply for dental assisting, even though I can't test to save my life. So right now I am in Riley's driveway at her parents' house and we are going to our corporate event at the Horizon Center. And I originally thought I was just dropping her off so she could get a car to go to karate, but no, I'm taking her with me. We're gonna get steak and shake afterwards. And then tomorrow's her surprise party, which she kind of knows about, but she doesn't know like what we're doing. She doesn't know that Benoit Blanc is gonna make an appearance. That wasn't good, but that's what we're doing. Riley, 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 Riley. Yes. I'm your biggest fan. I am blinded. Can you just leave my triple kibble and me alone? I cannot open these things, like, legitimately. Are you so excited to go to Steak and Shake tonight? You know I am. It's a five o'clock free crack giveaway. What are you gonna order? What's your order? Tell me your order. Riley, Riley, Riley. No, I'm not I'm you paparazzi. Right now. <laughs> you're like the worst paparazzi I've ever seen in my life. What do you want me to do? Because you're in. I wouldn't expect paparazzi here. I also look super tired. So like, super We're tired. all super tired. It's fine. You badmintoned. I badmintoned so hard today. I could barely breathe. <laughs> like legitimately. <laughs> all right, rolling. Parkour. <laughs> you missed so bad. Me Wait, you, See, you should. Well, I did, I you should. Cry. You should pick that one up so that it doesn't look like you did it before. So we can be like first try.
basket. No. <laughs> you got it. First time. Life Todd reaction. <laughs> Live to say for yourself, Claire. Steak and shake. The peoples want to know. Now, now that you've in, started in sports. Now that I've won the Super Bowl, we're going to steak and shake. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, that's not, this isn't Super Bowl. This is, what's this? I, you're looking at the wrong person, Todd. No, but like, no, what's, what's, what's the basketball? NBA thing? Finals. NBA Finals. It's right not the there. Steely Cup playoffs. No. I know that. What was that <laughs> thing you just did there? Establishing shot. The event went super well and I'm trying not to like get the flash in her face, but um, we are getting ready to go to bed, finishing up, watching some fancy moms, and then we have Riley's birthday party tomorrow. Sorry baby, I'll get it out of your face. On my run, today's gonna be super busy. I had therapy this morning, got my new glasses, played Webkins. After this, I'm in a shower do some work for the restaurant on my computer and then make some icing because we're doing Riley's birthday today. So it's a busy day, I'll take you along. I have food in my mouth, don't look at me. <laughs> you guys, my book of the month came in. I think this is the guy who wrote The Silent Patient, which is why I got this. And then another Allie Hazelwood because I've now lost my Allie Hazelwood virginity. Welcome to the friend zone. Cute. I'll probably take a break from my Riley Sager. It's not amazing. Maybe he's a one hit wonder, who knows? But yeah, I'm probably gonna read some romance. I need like, I don't know, after I read The Chaperone, I think thriller and mystery and like that type of thing, like dystopia, I already didn't like, but God, I think I just need a break from that, you know? So I was gonna go on a run, but I hadn't read a whole book this entire month. So I just sat down and read all of Love Theoretically. I started it last night, read about like 150 pages and then I just finished it today. It was so cute. Honestly shocked we didn't get an I love you, but you know, it's, it's overrated, right? Being in love is overrated. <laughs> Anyways, it was cute. You'll hear a more in-depth review in my wedding ride in March, but I'm about to start lessons in chemistry. Home Before Dark, I think I just, I don't know what I want to do with it. I need to make a decision though by tomorrow because today's Saturday, tomorrow Sunday. I have plans on Monday. So it's like, I need to make a decision tomorrow whether I want to finish it or not. And it's super disappointing because I finished all of like his other books. I just didn't like them. I only liked the only one left. And like, that's one of my favorite thrillers. So I hope this starts to get interesting, but I'm just going to start reading Lessons in Chemistry. I have a signed copy, a little flex, but that's what I'm going to be doing for the rest of today before work because then I have to go to work. I was about to go on my run, but I don't think I'm allowed. We see, am I allowed? Am I allowed or do I have to give you one tension? Yeah. I'm gonna go. And we'll cuddle later. Okay, okay? It's gonna be where I go ahead and end it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you in the next one.